found you. You'll have to catch me first. No fair, you're bigger than me. Yeah, but you can hide better, so it evens out. Fine, one more round. No, no, it's bedtime now. Oh. Uh... You won't want to get up in the morning for school. All right, you two. I know this routine. What story do you want? <laughs> Can you tell us the story of Dad joining the track team? If you two go to bed. We will. Fifteen years ago, your dad wanted to be just like his father. He trained for months to join the track team, and was looking forward to nothing more than the race that would classify him as part of the team. During the race, he almost lost, but he didn't give up and he got admitted. The best part is, is that we met on that very day. Now you two go to bed. All right, good night, mommy. I can't be late. <sighs> Made it. Hey, Brad. Hey, Jackson. Did you hear? Hear what? Uh, about the girl who started going to our school. No, I've been more focused on something else. On what? In two months, they have track tryouts, and I really want to join, just like my father. You should go for it. I plan to, but I'm worried I'm not fast enough. Then see Coach Poole after school. I'm sure he could judge your running. That's a great idea! Ten times better than the garbage you give me usually. How dare. Name one bad idea I had. We should kill her. She hurt my ship! Brad, it's a slice of life. And I need her to be sliced up. There should be a fighting game where every fighter is toast with faces. Do you think the Greek gods are real? Dude, no. Okay, most of those were dumb. But I still like Toast Warriors. Of course you do. When I first saw you you caught my eye by the way you dab to be honest oh give me a moment Ugh, i hate this class oh please you hate everything do you know who you're talking to obviously but i've got a feeling you're gonna remind me anyway i'm pop josephine the best girl in school and there it is whatever says me like that and you'll feel my wrath. No one messes with Bob Josephine's gang. Really don't care. Why you little... Did you hear they're making a new Scooby-Doo movie? Can't you see I'm talking to him? 
Was that the wind? I'm going to get you two for this humiliation. Is she trying to be tough? Sadly, yes. Take a seat, class. Today we will be learning about the French Revolution and its importance in the modern day. How's your taco? It's okay, but honestly, the school food is pretty underwhelming. Agreed. That's why I always pack my lunch. You looking at Noah again? Well, yeah, uh, n no, um, uh, <laughs> Dude, you've liked him since sixth grade, just ask him out. I don't know how. Just walk up to him and ask him out. That's easy for you to say. How many crushes have you asked out? Fair point. But still, you should at least talk to him a little. I can't do it, and I really want to ask him. Well, you're going to have to soon, because the 8th grade dance is in two months. Yeah... Hi, Coach Poole. Hi, you look familiar. Well, you are my father, Oliver O'Ryan's coach. I know, Jackson. I have your name on the register. Um, I just wanted to ask a favor. Anything for my best runner's son? I want you to judge me running to see how far I have to go to join the track team. Sure, I love the commitment. Three, two, one, go. <sighs> how did I do? Well, you're faster than most kids, but knowing how fast people who try up the track are, I don't think you'll make it. Oh. You have two months, and if you train hard enough, you can still qualify to join the team. Really? Yes. Just know that training takes time, and you won't see results overnight. I know, but I'm going to do it for him. That's the spirit. Where are you going? I'm going out for a run. I'll be back in an hour or two.